Good morning. Um, I will admit I was in a unpleasant mood yesterday afternoon. Um, some things I just need to kind of figure out. Some life challenges that I need to address that were kind of weighing heavily on me. So, and you know, I don't like doing videos when I'm not in a good mood. So, I think some of it translated. So, I'm going to do my, I'm going to definitely do better today. Um, I, look, it's a clean slate. It's too clean to do list. I'm gonna write it down. I have full gloves on because it's freezing. The um, furnace ran out of water overnight, so I think it was 52 this morning. Um, maybe a whole 54 now, so it's gonna take a while to warm up the house. So I thought I would give myself some nourishment um, by way of um, naked juice, and I believe this is. Um, kale, kiwi, pineapple, um, spinach, banana. It's delicious. It it looks like sewage, but it's tasty. So you kind of have to not look at it, which is perfect because when I drink, I drink from this end. And I'm just not looking at that. So once I finish that, I will take my supplements and I have a lovely, I know it looks like schmadas floating around in the water, but this is a Mayo Lemon Seltzer that um, I try to drink before I go to bed and when I get up in the morning, so um, it's, it keeps me um, hydrated, so that's good. So I'm going to drink my juice, take my supplement, which I have right here, which I think I have to refill shortly. Yeah, I have three days left in there, so I'll refill those probably on Friday because that's my Friday fill-up for... Um, my supplements and Polly's pills. And then we're going to get this day started. I have a couple of videos I need to make today, so I have to probably sketch up my little plan. I usually do um, at least, at minimum, a little mental um, checklist of what I want to talk about. And then um, there's a couple of projects I need to complete. So yeah, it should be a fun day. It's a little gloomy out, but at least it's warmer. It's uh, 29 degrees, and we're supposed to have some snow showers. Oh no, it's tomorrow. It's 24 right now, and cloudy. So, we'll, we'll make the best of the day that has to offer to us, but um, I love mornings. Um, I love Mondays. It's like fresh start, so I'm going to get a good fresh start, and I'll check in with you guys throughout the day. So I was having a not-so-fabulous day residuals from yesterday and some stuff that I still have to resolve and it's not anything that nothing catastrophic it's just you know life's challenges so uh, I think karma took pity on me and I got a we are memory keepers uh, installment from uh, HSN and the adorable sweet stamp shop um, set of the letters and numbers and these totally remind me of the Tim Holtz. Let's see, I think I even have it right next to me. Oh, look at that. Right in my desk drawer. Remind me of these labels. And um, I, it's not that I'm running out exactly. I still have some. But these I could totally do in whatever color I want. Because they're solid. And then be whatever color of the background paper. So just in time for all sorts of holidays. So it has uh, day, love, birthday, happy, you think anniversary a little tiny heart and then all the letters and numbers and symbols so I think that'll be cute and I'm gonna do a separate video of this because I think this is the last installment I wish I knew whether that was or not but yeah I'll do that separately so yeah thank you karma I do appreciate when you smile upon me it's refreshing and put a smile on my face so I'm gonna dig into this on camera so I can you can see my instant reaction or my authentic reaction. So have, since I have been asking a question each day, do you want to run away from where your current weather situation is to various things. So today's question is going to be, would you be interested in seeing my weekly menu in advance so you could possibly get some supplies to make the same thing or similar thing. Um, I used to, I think for the year 2012, I did a weekly menu in my A5 
final facts, including Meatless Mondays, that's why it's green, and I would post this, I think I, I have a whole Pinterest board, um, the file effects frenzy Pinterest board has all of the uh, previous weekly um, menus but if you are interested please let me know um, I know I periodically get questions about food probably because I share so much of what food we're having making whatever so in the comments below let me know would you be interested in seeing a weekly menu plan um, maybe including ingredients you tell me how much how little do you want some inspiration? You know, do you want to try different kinds of food? I picked up uh, several more ingredients that I needed. I wanted to um, restock in my pantry in yesterday's big grocery shop. So let me know. And today I'm going to take a little break from Wild Art Crafts Retired Products. And I'm going to give away this adorable Quick Cuts Lifestyle Crafts uh, embossing folder frame. And this is a sponsor uh, sponsored by my local scrapbooking store, Inspiration Station. I'll include a link below. Who's also having a design team call right now? So check out that information. I believe it's on their blog and Debbie's blog. So thank you, Debbie, for um, uh, you know sponsoring today's giveaway. So uh, leave a comment to be eligible. You really should be a subscriber. I'm not going to whip anybody with a wet noodle if they're not, but, you know, it's really kind of a reward for people who follow along my little antics and adventures. So, and I'll be drawing these, you know, each of the daily winners will be announced a week later um, on the actual video. So stay tuned, check back. So that's today's little giveaway. It's the Lifestyle Crafts Frame Embossing Folder. It's really pretty and you could use it either way. There you go. So I have a couple things I need to finish up for work and then we'll see. I'm not sure what kind of adventures we're going to get into food. Um, I'm full. I have a coffee I'm still kind of nursing and it's a decaf because otherwise my brain will be buzzing all night. I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. But I am vowing to go to bed by 11 o'clock tonight, so, and that means I have to wrap up the vlog earlier and so I can edit it. So we'll see. We'll see how well I could stick to my own schedule. So there you go. February 2015. Loving these pens. I have to say, just, I love the way they, they write. Look at that. Nice and small, just really thin. And this is from, um... Dollar Tree was a four pack. Um, different colors blue, green, purple, and pink, I think. Hold on, let me grab them for my little. Yeah. Blue, blue, green, purple, and pink. There you go. A dollar, so a quarter each. Even if they write for a month, that'll be fine for, for me. Добрый вечер, мои дорогие друзья. Сейчас я играю со своими новыми stamps. Совсем забыла, как это сказать по-русски. Don't ask me why, but I just was felt compelled to speak Russian all of a sudden. And I'm sure it's with a heavier English accent, but it's okay. I've been in the States since I was 10, so it's rather miraculous that I could speak anything in Russian or understand anything in Russian or even read Russian. Although... Be warned, <laughs> when I read in Russian, I get a colossal headache because I have to think so hard. So, yeah. Well, I'm finishing off my coffee. And look, I'm playing with my new Alpha Tab set from Sweet Stamp Shop. And they are identical. Well, not identical, but they're similar to the... Uh, label letters from Tim Holtz and um, also kind of like the old-fashioned label makers the oh my gosh I don't have it in front of me but I know where it is so I could show it to you and I've had the sniffles today no idea what's going on but and it's rather warm it's a whole 37 degrees and cloudy so yeah I'm really loving these 
I even posted an Instagram picture and I think I tweeted this because they're just so stinking cute. And again, I'm using my little trick of having multiples on a block, so I really only need to use three blocks for all these letters. So, yeah. Cute. So, and I'll include a link directly to the stamp, stamp set if you're interested, if you haven't seen it. It looks rather unassuming, but boy, is it adorable. So, because these are stamps, you can use whatever color you want. I love the full coverage, and the, really the only reason none of them are, not, some of them are not stamped accurately is because I did this really quickly, so I just didn't ink it up accurately. But look at the beautiful coverage on the ones that I did. So I was using the uh, Versafine Onyx Black, my favorite for detailed um, stamping. I have them in different colors. These would look so cute on an Easter card, or spring, or Mother's Day. Oh, adorbs. Ah. Adorable. All right, I think I'm gonna need to go open up a box of tissues and properly blow my nose off camera. No worries, off camera. And I'm thinking I might make um, those little lamb chops I have. They look like tiny little T-bone steaks, like itty bitty, like this big. So there's four in a package, so it's two per person, and they're really, really stinking cute. And I have some asparagus and green beans that Eric Carver's that I need to use up. So I'm thinking that maybe um, a little green salad. So it'll be greens and uh, lamb chops. But we'll see how Polly's tummy is doing. He's he said he's been upset all day, so I might just end up making him soup and have leftovers myself. So still up in the air, and that's basically how it goes because you kind of have to. Um, I'm sure. A lot of people can relate to this, man, men or women. Sometimes you really have to bend with the wind. Otherwise, if you're too rigid, you'll snap and break. So somebody I know has a tummy ache. So what's good for a tummy ache? Oatmeal with some fresh fruit. And maybe a little surprise. How's that? That should put a smile on his face, don't you think? So because Polly wasn't feeling good, I made him oatmeal. I totally forgot about making dinner for myself, so I decided to just have a bowl of fruit. So I have bananas, uh, tangerines, kiwi, persimmon, which is perfectly ripe, and strawberries. I'm going to go enjoy that, and that's going to be it for us to, for today. Thank you so much for stopping by and keeping us company. Check out the yummy fruit I have for later in the week. Melon and papaya and mango and avocados. Oh, yumminess. And in the other basket like this, it's completely filled to the top with oranges. So, yeah, we're all set. Oh, and I squeezed some Meyer lemon over all of these fruits. So, oh, I'm going to go enjoy that now. Thank you again. We will see you all tomorrow. Don't forget about the thumbs up and don't forget to leave a comment if you want to enter or if you want to be eligible to win, uh, for a chance to win that embossing folder thanks to Inspiration Station. Thank you, Debbie, again. We'll see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching, everyone.